Hello guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel, The Rich Post, and I hope you all are doing great. So, guys, in this working video, I'm going to show you Angular 14 e commerce site add to cart functionality. So, guys, before showing you working demo and code, I must say please pause the video till the end and please subscribe my channel for latest Angular updates. So, guys, here we go. And guys one thing I must say I'm working on it I'm working on this functionality like I will make mini cart as well so first we will see add to cart functionality and shopping cart items so guys here you can see angular 14 is working fine and also you can see few products or I can say three products and below shopping cart count zero and low like a table structure has name price and action so very first I'm going to add one product like Z900 add to cart see so guys product added and in the shopping cart you can see the added product and also increase the count to one product image name price and action or quantity I can increase see guys also counter increase for shopping cart see guys and now I will add one more product helmet add to cart see guys add it also the cart count I can add more five and four total nine and now I will add the gloves Add it, see guys, total 10, 5, 4, and 1. Increase the quantity here as well. And guys, like I said, I'm making this functionality more better, like total price, and I will also show the mini card section here inside the pop up. So, guys, now I'm going to remove few products first I will remove this like quantity zero product remove or nine I can directly like this zero moved and one left see the quantity also changing and shopping cart count you guys removed again I will show you the angle 14 I will add again like helmet you guys bike and gloves you guys. box well total three count three delete it delete and delete helmet this one and this one you guys increase the quantity very sharp so guys have you seen angular 14 Add to cart functionality for e-commerce site is working fine and guys I will also share the course report link inside the video description very soon like I said I will make this functionality more better like I will add the mini cart section also the shopping cart total price as well so guys if you will have any kind of query suggestion or requirements then please comment on this video also please contact me via my blog i will share all the details in this video description and friends in the end i must say thank you for watching this video thank you have a nice day take care bye bye